Nah, uh huh, girl, we gon' ride in the homeboy. JTV crew, salute. Guess what? And we are back with another video for you today. How are you beautiful people doing? Hope you're all okay, all blessed. Damn, it's still hot in this bit, but I love the heat. I really do. Mm -mm. <laughs> but <laughs> today I'm going to be checking out, yo, Kira Love and song we call You Lie To Me. You Lie To Me. <laughs> Sounds like it's going to be a meaningful tune. I can't wait. Now, Stalin, bit. Let's get straight into it. Zoop. Don't sound like it's gonna be a slow jam, but I feel like it's it's gonna be meaningful, yo. That, that's cool, and as long as it's catchy, thank you very much. <laughs> Hold up, did she just walk in and see her man with a girl or am I just stunning? Oh, shut up. This phone gets on my nerves, man, with work always messaging me, man. Just leave me the heck alone. <laughs> Did she just say, speak to the Lord, but he going deaf? <laughs> Damn. I feel you. I feel what you're trying to say. Praying, trying to ask for, you know, that request and still ain't happening. Like this dude. Hey, it's not even the dudes, man. It's females as well. This new generation is messed up, yo. But she hella cute. I mean, most, I mean, some of these people, I'm one of those ones. If I go through something and I experience something, I'm really inspired to write a song, for real. I don't know if she went through this or whatnot. Maybe, maybe not. But I'm really digging it from the from the jump, from the get-go. I'm feeling the video. I'm feeling Mara as well. She's quite beautiful, even if she did get stood up that kind of way. That's tough. Let me just pull that back to the start, because I'm really feeling this. Sorry, yeah, I'm just styling car. I'm just thinking, yo, Mara's kind of looking fly still. If that ever happened, like, man. If I had a fly female, why would you go and do that, you feel me? I don't know, man. I, I really don't know. New generation is about bus stops here, and bus stops and up over here, and bus stops over here again. You know what I'm saying? There's loads of bus stops, so them buses, you know, doing doing a lot of stops. <laughs> it's tough. I had to take my hat off and everything. She, you with a girl, dude? And that other girl just done said, brother, I'm telling you. That's crazy. When another female tells, I'm guessing she decided you. Telling her she met your mama, that is pain. That's, you know what? I, I feel that, that's tough. That's real tough. I mean, cheating, you know what I'm saying? That's already tough. But now, she met your mama before she did. Not saying that she should have met her before, but I'm trying to say, that's a double, 
BAM him in the face. That's trying to say you're the side chick type bitch. That's one o'clock. Oh my god, that's a double whammy in the face. I swear to you. She met your mama <laughs> and she hasn't. Oh, that's tough. Someone gonna get beat up tonight. <laughs> She she cute too. Ooh, I feel that vibe. I wasn't gonna say it, but I'm gonna say it. I'm feeling that vibe right there. Yo, Ma was like, you know what? I got the girls, I got the homies, you know what? Yeah. Oh boy, he must have felt boxed up. You know when you put an insect in a box and they, you, you know what I'm saying, as a little kid, and you just look at it like, shit, he ain't got no life. You're just gonna stay there till you die, unfortunately. So as you know, we used to, some of us used to do as kids some crazy ish. He's now like boxed up like one of those insects. Getting it left, right, and center. That's sad. That's real deep. I mean, is it sad? He's probably getting what he deserves, but Ma, the way she just opened up that door and expressing how she felt like, whoa, she went in, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> She's like, no, I'm hungry. We gonna ride in the home, boy. <laughs> Damn. Then I swear you had some nerve asking me why I'm bluffing, cause you lied to me. Why you ain't just tell me you was tired of me? Damn, like, now I swear to God you really trying me. Give me everything you asked for, you still deny me. Blaming me for demons that you wanna put inside of me. Oh, I, oh, I love what she's just said there. Nothing. Then I swear you had some nerve asking me why I'm bluffing, cause you lied to me. Why you ain't just tell me you was tired of me? Damn, like. Facts, B. Facts, B. You know what I'm saying? I remember one time I was dating one girl and I actually kind of felt like she was boring But I didn't really want to hurt her feelings You know what I'm saying? Until I was bored I didn't know any other kind of way to tell her Slowly, slowly, and gradually should I say The relationship did fizzle out Um, I did try, you know what I'm saying? I know I was getting bored but I did try and, you know Try and see if it was gonna improve I'm Trying to spice up my life See if, I, I'm not one of those ones that just drop a, a, a girl and try and move on to her next that's not me so i kind of held on but um it didn't really go too well um it on things only got worse so um we kind of took a break that ish didn't work because they just ended up cheating on me you feel me so but i still felt some type of way i still i was i was in my feelings you know what i'm saying <sighs> man that's the struggle but i really like what she was saying there man Facts, another facts. Yo, they, oh my god, the demons you put inside of me. Some of these people be playing mind games, you know, I'm, I'm crush up the feelings. I hate mind games. And then they, they, they put the demons inside you and make you try and look bad. Oh my, they flip everything on you, man. I so hate that ish. Damn. When you're in a relationship, you know what I'm saying, you try and go to sleep because you need some rest before you go work or do whatever you got to do. And it's like, your problems still haunt you in your dreams. And that's flipping crazy. I ain't had that for years. You know, your boy's been single for a hell of a long time. I don't do stress or problems. But listen, no negativity, straight positivity is what I do. So, boy, I, I've, I'm really feeling what Ma is putting in her bars or lyrics whatever you want to call it, wherever you're from. An experience I had is, is, is kind of relevant, kind of, you know, touching where I'm, I'm, I be feeling, you know what I'm saying? So it's, it's making me feel some type of way, like, I'm, you know when you connect to a song 
you've experienced something just like so you really connect to a song so you feel like yeah i'm gonna download this every time you listen to this song it will never get old because you've always you know through the experience the past that's haunted you always be there you focused on you know for the better and you learn from those experiences and and hopefully hopefully <laughs> you learn from those experiences and will never <laughs> happen again <laughs> And this part is catchy, the chorus. I didn't like it at first, but it gets into you, it drills into you, yo. Especially when you love the verses. I mean, Ma, I'm not being judge. I'm being judgmental. I know I'm gonna be judgmental, but Ma <laughs> looks one of those ones like she from the hood. She'll give you a right hook, you know what I'm saying? Maybe a little lefty. You know what I'm saying? She just standing there like she about to knock that you the hell out, homeboy. I swear, just look, look at her facial expression. I'm not saying this is her, but it's just the way her body movement or the way she, her body and her face is kind of showing me, kind of like, yo, she would knock a homeboy out, KO. Just, just to watch, yo, just watch. Just watch from this part. Watch. Watch this part, yo. Look, look. Except for that part when she was like, she let go of her two hands, like, you know what, no more, I flicked the hair and kind of done a cute smile to the left or should i say to the right her right or left you feel me man i like i like i like i like <laughs> i really do like one of those girls that think they're hard but really they're not they're, 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 they're cute hard does that make any sense they act hard but really they're really soft when you like you know hug them play with them they act hard but they're not hard you feel me i like them kind of girls man they're cute <laughs> I did like this video yet again another meaningful song I can relate to most of y'all can definitely relate to not just the women the guys too I like the video but I felt at some part she should have been more serious than just laughing about because it kind of at the end she was laughing about maybe that was her intention to say yo dude you're just a joke I don't know to me it just felt a bit like it kind of lost I kind of lost it there like why she keep laughing like the thing is actually serious you understand me that <laughs> But hey, maybe I just got the wrong message from there. But I do really like this song. Man, hopefully this this <laughs> this generation will change and hopefully we'll get better. But these days all I hear is people getting divorced. People young and pregnant. People young and pregnant without baby fathers. You know what I'm saying? Or they just get bred up or breed up wherever you're from. Well, man, where I'm from, we just say bred up. And the dude just gone and breed up someone else like um well like animals these days. That's crazy. It's not everywhere, but it's starting to become a trend. It's not really what I grew up, what my parents grew me up, you know, tradition and all this. It doesn't have to be a government to say that you've been married or anything as long as you're together, but it's just man, I don't know man. The values of being married or being together, forget marriage, being together and being a family without splitting up. It's like non-existent these days. For y'all that do keep that down and hold it hard, yo, respect to you, salute you for me. I understand when we're young we need to have fun, but just have protection, man. Just take extra precautions. That's something y'all told me, yo, do it because you want to extend your family tree. Hey, who am I to say anything? But yo, man, it's tough. It's tough. Thank you very much again. I'll see y'all beautiful people tomorrow. JTV Crew. Salute. <laughs>